Good morning, we are just motoring out here into quite a picturesque, uh, not so much the weather is picturesque, but the uh, area is very picturesque. And it's sort of like a main river and lots of offshoots. And I've sort of come up here to get out of the wind, so. Um, oh, there's the wind there, in this part. So we'll try and get out of the wind over here and we'll just check some creek mouths to start. Um, and then we'll follow the tide up and right up into the skinny creeks. We just need to get through this and out to there, so. That's the deal. That's the deal today. So hopefully we can find a few, a few jacks or whatever. I'm just going to get through this slop. It's just sloppy ass. So, um, anyways, all right. I'm going to concentrate on this. You guys have a look at some scenery, and uh, we'll catch you over there. this stuff with a bit of frogging and um, see how we go. Alright, so I'm going to go with the white frog first up. Oh, he's missed it. Damn. Oh, Jacko. <laughs> Crunched it. Oh, it's a Trevally. Oh, damn it. Trevally. Start us off with a little Trev. A little Trev on a frog. Crunched it. There he goes. He's very spiky, man. Here we go. Little fella. Pink. Say, Matt. Come on, something hit me. Hit me with your best shot, come on. There's one. That was red too, that one. Here he goes. Oh, yep, got him. That's a barrel. There's a barrel and a jack in there. <laughs> he just snuck up on it. He just snuck up on it. <laughs> Awesome. That's cool. <laughs> little barrel. Stick him in the net. Here we go, little Baz. Woo! <laughs> oh, and the frog. Frog lot. Little barrel on the frog. He's a cranky little dude. Hey, there he is. Bit of frog. Frog barra action. So that's pretty cool. Get you, there you go, son. There you go. Get you looking good. I think there was a there was a jack in there as well because I saw the first one come up was a big um, red splash and it didn't even pop the hook. It just sort of hit the back. And then uh, I twitched a little bit more and then I stopped and then I just saw this silver thing come out of the water underneath it and I just left it and it went poof. So yeah, it's pretty cool. Anyways, we'll get him back in, eh? Little fella. Alright, very cool stuff, very, very cool. So, this is the kind of zones now that I'm going to try and replicate on these outsides. So, we're basically the main bit of the uh, river or channel, whatever you want to call it, is out there. And then we've got all these creeks coming in. So, I'm going to concentrate on these points now. And you get these little, oh, I don't know what the word is, but it's a big flat. It's a big flat through here. So at low tide, this is all dry. So I assume they're pushing up here. They're not up here for a haircut, they're up here to eat. So 
yeah, we'll sort of concentrate on these areas and see if we can get a couple more. So it was pretty cool. Looking for a jack though. Am looking for a jack. So let's see how we go. All right, back in there. Let's get back in there. There's another one. Yep. That's one. Yep. Another one. That's uh, Trev, I think. Oh, man. He's going. He's going hard, that one. That one's spot. <laughs> Nailed it. <laughs> oh, shit. He's going, going around the back there. Get him around the back. So there's jacks, there's barrow, there's a bit of everything in there. Pretty cool. Oh, another Trev on the frog. Except me frog's gone. Where'd me frog go, mate? He absolutely came out and nailed that. And he's, uh, <laughs> I don't know where my frog went, but it's gone. So, very good fun in close quarters. It's the same as uh, pontoon fishing, they were always very good fun in close quarters. But um, on a frog, that's very cool. Very cool on a frog. But yeah, we'll get him back in and uh, see if we can get another one eh? or something else. A jack would be good other than a Trev and a Barrow. Not that I'm complaining, but that's what we're kind of looking for. Grunter. See you, Grunter. Come back and eat it. Come on, eat it. There you go. Oh, you bastard. He's still there. Look. Come on, eat it. Eat it. Oh, yep. <laughs> <laughs> loser. Absolute loser. Yep. Oh, man. They suck. Suck balls. There's one. No. No, he's missed it again. He's just missed it. Missed, missed, missed. Good cast. That is actually a good cast. Oh no, not a good cast. Oh, he came for a long way to get that. He came from a very long way to get that. There's one. Oh, Barra, Barra. Man, what happened there? He barely even popped it, dude. Got it. Oh, you bastard. This is the cutest barrow ever. <laughs> cutest barrow ever. Come on, eat it. Oh, he's just turned on it at the last minute. What is he doing? Kidding me? My frog was in there and nothing happened. Oh my god. I didn't get anything.
There's one. Yep. All right. Oh, it's a jack. That's a jack, that one. You got me deep. Oh, mate. Up you go. That is a jack. Jack on a frog. <laughs> Love it, Jack and a frog. Not a bad, not a bad Jack either. Hey, not a bad Jack. Right, that's what we're after. Jack on a frog. He's not bad either. He's like mid forties, so I'm pretty happy with that. First, first Jack on a top border, and um, first Jack on a plastic too. Actually, my, all my fish have been pontoon fish, jerkbait fish. So yeah, he's not a bad fish at all. So we'll pop that out. Wasn't actually, wasn't actually in there that well. So we'll pop that out. Oh, he's feisty. He's feisty. He's very feisty. So we'll get that popped out of him and get him back in the water. Mate. So I'll just show you how I'm rigging these frogs. This is a Z-Man hard legs, I think they're called, the bigger ones. So basically, this is a Gamagatsu hook as well, a 6.0 hook. So you just want to take a bite of that. And basically you want to fill this piece, this piece of the hook up with that piece of plastic. So when it sits on there, it's covering that front piece. So if you go too shallow, your frog's going to sit up like that. And if you, you know, don't go shallow enough, it's going to sit down like that. So just make sure you've got enough to sit it flush on there. And then that'll sit under there like that. So you just put your hook in there like so. And then I just bend it. And then it pops in. It pops in at the back there. So yeah, that's it there. Okay. Now, before we do that... We, um, I like to put this Lumo bead on. So what you do with the Lumo bead, is cut it in half. So you've got two halves. Two halves like that. Right? That's pretty hard to see, but you got a flat side and a round side, right? So basically, you thread that on. You thread that piece on like that, all the way down. So the flat sides, the flat sides that way for the underneath the chin, and that'll just stop you. That'll just stop your frog from slipping down. So it just sits under there like that. See that? So that'll just stop that coming down just on skip casting or whatever. And then the next one, you put it the opposite way. So it's like the flat piece is gonna face the plastic. And you just scoot him down there like that to about there and then you put your plastic back in and that'll just hold underneath there that'll hold underneath so that back doesn't slip down but if a fish eats it it'll pop it but it won't just slip down from just casting so just attach that with a loop knot and you're good to go that tide has well and truly turned now from um, being a bloody uh, four. It was, it was coming in a little bit this morning, then dropped off. So it's, yeah, it's well and truly banging now, and we got the wind as well. So time to change tactics. But I think there's enough this morning to be its own little self-contained video. So I'm going to tease the next video, <laughs> even though I haven't caught anything yet. But this afternoon, I'm just going to go and fish these drains in the low and fish all this stuff that's coming out so uh, hopefully I can get something doing that and um, this will be its own thing and uh, I'll see you on the next one whatever you want it to be mate whatever you want <laughs> yeah 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 that'd be funny actually hey I'd laugh but it's almost like it's getting to that ridiculous stage where you have to fucking basically you know, like Photoshop, like fish and stuff, you know, like, oh, here's a jack. Oh, is that a little barra? Yep, barra. Oh, fuck. Nah, I just missed a barra. Nah, he ate it and he just didn't pop the hook on the frog.